Good morning, good afternoon, or good night, or whatever time it may be in your part of the world. My name is Mr. John Wayne, and I am a variety gamer. I play everything from the Fallout franchise all the way to the Soulsborne series. Welcome, everybody, to another episode of my Let's Play of Dragon's Dogma 2. I hope you're all doing well. I know that I am. And today, we're finally going to get started on the main quest again. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get started. It is nighttime because we want to talk to Captain Brant. There is much we ought to tend to if we are to strengthen your majesty's claim as a true arisen. Tell me of the Queen Regent. You will need to infiltrate the palace to gather evidence of Deezer's misdeeds. I hesitate to ask something so dangerous of you, yet I fear we have few other options. I have attempted to do the same through my own channels before now, though I have yet to uncover so much as a whisper of her plots. Would that I could undertake the task myself, but my station prohibits me from reckless action. What say you? Your Majesty. Might I ask this task of you? Sure, I'll see what she's up to. I shall ensure that the door to the Queen Regent's office is open between midnight and dawn. Pray use that time to conduct your investigation. Let's rest until midnight. I am not escorting How you do again. You fare? Would you hear my request? Sorry, Ulrika. Can't do it. Sorry I am to hear it. Feel like they're Preston Garvey quests from Fallout 4. No, I'm not going over there. We're going to take out our soldier gear. Because we're going to be going into the castle. I want to be prepared. Just in case we need it. Let's rest until nightfall. A good sleep will ensure we are prepared for the morrow. Awesome. We'll just keep doing the Cyclops until we earn that badge for Lucy here. Do an item. Maybe we have a ton of copper gold. Maybe we'll give this to somebody life taker to this world i return ready to put all i've learned to use open your eyes everyone it is dark out but our day begins step lively journey by starlight shall make for a nice change of pace feeling rested i trust i took a wrong turn i should have went straight we're going up to the castle, so we gotta go this way. No matter how many times I run through Vernworth, I still cannot remember the layout. It's a very windy city. 
There's a ladder here. Perhaps new discoveries await us above. Do you know how long you You are the Arisen, yes? The captain gave me your description. Follow me! I shall follow you. Where are you going, lady? I hope the weather holds. Was this all place quiet as a mill? I always despair to see the sun fall. It's well tiring being so alert all day long. Tis best you move along. Should one of the other guards espy you, I will be forced to play my part. Pray be cautious, Your Majesty. Let's put on our armor just to be safe. I have not explored the castle yet. Wow. That's pretty cool. They actually give you some of this armor before you even get in here. Good to know. How do we get... Is there a spot over here? This sort of quiet means all's well. Yeah, I'll have to definitely come back here and um, explore. Who's there? Pray, keep your voice low. Twouldn't be good for either of us if someone was summoned to come check on me. It's Sven. See, I knew, I knew it. He's the queen's son, for sure. Could it be that you have come to bring mother's schemes to light? Aye, Deesa is my mother. Pray forgive me for not telling you sooner. It was never my intent to deceive you. I simply feared that if I spoke the truth, none would wish to involve themselves with me. But that is no longer a concern. It is clear that we are allied in purpose. My word, you mean to say that you are the true Arisen? That the Sovereign currently residing in the palace is a pretender? Could Mother have had a hand in that as well? Regent Kin Sven appears to be missing from his chambers. Have you seen him? Me? No, sir. Then start searching, you fool. Should aught befall the Regent Kin, tis us who'll answer to her grace. Forgive me. My absence seems to have made this rather more difficult for us. You ought to leave the palace at once. This room turned up little of interest, but I've a mind to look into this further. I shall send word to Captain Brandt if I discover aught you should know. I'll head out first and speak with the Sentinels. Use that opportunity to make good your escape. Okay, so escape through the window. Where have you been? Forgive me. I couldn't sleep. I thought a stroll might clear my head. Prithee inform us when you leave your chamber. If Doesn't seem like there's anything else in here. Whoa, whoa! Did not mean to slide down. This lead us back to where... I think this is where we came in at. Good to know. Let's go talk to Brant. Tis our duty to see this peace protected. 
Meager wages so like these won't for my belly. <laughs> I've been on my feet. Oh, our soldiers need better training. I'm surrounded by winches on all sides. Just yonder looks to be a good spot for harvesting ingredients. No harm in picking a few. Won't someone do all about this? What do you got to say? Beg pardon, sir, but might I have a moment of your time? I've a proposal to make, and methinks you'll want to hear it. See, a friend of mine has an empty house, but no use for it. And I see you round the inn rather often. Understand me? Wouldn't come free, mind, but the price is a fair one, and you'd have a place to call your own. What say you? Jesus, 200,000? No, I'm good. I already have a place to call home. Thank you, though. Well, you needn't decide this very moment. Come speak with me again once your mind's set. Yeah, I'm not buying that house. I'd rather become, like, super rich. Seems I'm not the only one who's too busy to rest this morning. There is much we ought to tend to if we are to strengthen your majesty's claim as a true arisen. How fared your mission? Was there aught suspicious to be found in the Queen Regent's office? Actually, there was. Check out this torn letter I found. This scrap. T'was part of a letter. And from Batal, no less. This alone can prove little, but tis clear that Deez's schemes run deep. To think. Deezer's actions have weighed even on the mind of her own son. Tis a surprise, but a welcome one. Deezer is a, the doting mother before the Regent King. If Regent King Sven is willing to aid us by drawing Deezer's focus, we may be able to gain here more useful information. You have done well, Your Majesty. Though I am limited in the aid I am able to offer, I bid you, take this. What could the Queen Region be plotting? Nice. Got some I'm not gold. Sure what we're dealing with here. Queen Region Deesa appears to be working in concert with this phaser's fellow. But what the no, I'm not even gonna look at Spellbound, that thing. <laughs> that quest has me so aggravated. Precisely is their aim. There is much we ought to tend to. If we are to strengthen your majesty's claim as a true arisen, do not forget that we work to serve the city. Is that it? What, what do I do now? Let's try resting a gin. Our destination is rather distant. Perhaps we ought to consider employing the services of an ox guard. No. A most agreeable suggestion. Of course, the Arisen shall have the final. Let's rest okay, until nightfall. Rest, then. See if we can't. The sun may have fallen, but the day is far from over. Shall we check Talk our path to off? Shall we the captain get again? Underway? There is much we ought to tend to, if we are to strengthen your majesty's claim as a true arisen. Tell me these rumors about Allard. I bear word from Regent Ken Sven, your majesty. He espied the delivery of a suspicious package to a man named Allard, a minister who happens to be one of the Queen Regent's staunchest and most powerful allies in the palace. From the pains he took to remain on scene, it is plain that Allard wished this delivery kept away from prying eyes. 
That alone is reason to suspect a connection to Deezer's schemes. We must get to the bottom of it. The Regent Kin intends to call Allard to his chambers come nightfall. He bids you to use this opportunity to search the Minister's chambers and see if there is aught to be learned. What say you, Your Majesty? Are you willing to undertake this task? Sure, I'll see what Allard's up to, what he's scheming. I shall ensure that the door to the Minister's chambers is open between midnight and dawn. Pray. Use that time to infiltrate and uncover aught worthy of suspicion. We have been entrusted with a task. Let us approach it with all due care. So we're going we back to the, the castle. Palace? Or palace, whatever. Castle, palace, it's all the same, right? Shall we make for Burnworth Palace? Yes, Let us we make are. for the palace that she oh might my investigate God. Minister People. Allard's chambers. I can accompany you to the castle entrance, Master, but no further. A guide is most welcome. Now we shan't lose our way. We're here, Master. We shall await you here, Master. You are the Arisen, yes? The captain gave me your description. Follow me! It's kind of weird. They use the same knight or soldier to say the same shit. She should know us. And this who just escorted us over here before. At least it looks like the same person. There are few places where I can let down my guard. It's best you move along. Should one of the other guards spy you, I will be forced to play my part. Pray be cautious, Your Majesty. Sure, I'll be cautious. I wish the minister would be more careful. He takes the sentinel posted outside his chambers with him everywhere. over here uh, the outside I think we might have to go upstairs again can we go up here sorry if I'm making anybody dizzy What business could be so pressing that I must be summoned at this late hour? I would not presume to know, my lord. However, it must be a highly sensitive matter for the Regent Kin to request a private audience. Or oh, perhaps the boy has finally grown wise to the benefits my favor can bring. He might just be his mother's puppet. But at least he knows what's good for him. M my lord, if someone were to overhear... Oh, unring your hands, you fool! As if anyone in this palace would dare say a word against me. Now, if Wilhelmina calls, tell her to await me in my chambers. I will return presently. I was going to say, is the soldier going to come out? Get in there, Mr. Wayne. What's running into candlesticks here? There's a way out there. Ah, okay. It's an obvious door. I'm 
surely none more important than this. I speak of the ascension of the Sovereign. Indeed. But that, Your Grace, would be better discussed in the presence of your mother. Uh, we better get out of here before he goes and comes in on us. How do we get down? Well, I was a little nervous I was going to take some fall damage, but I guess not. Well, well. We meet again. Is this stealthy business becoming a habit of yours? Oi! Who goes there? Who's there? Tut! Tut, now, this just won't do. How's a lady supposed to work with all these interruptions? Oh, it is you, Lady Wilhelmina. Mm-hmm. Do excuse us. We thought to enjoy a little fresh air. Though, we had hoped for slightly more privacy, if you catch my meaning. Apologies, my lady. But might I ask the name of your companion? Are you sure it would be wise? Such knowledge has been known to cost a man his head. Uh, understood, my lady. If anyone asks, I shall say I saw naught. Hmm. A narrow escape. You should count yourself lucky that he was so easily flustered. Why do you keep helping me? I don't appreciate having my motives questioned. I did as I saw fit. Need I say more? Something tells me this shan't be the last I see of you. Perhaps you'll be good enough to repay me when next we meet. I think this is the way we need to go. Mayhap I really would have been better off at Baker. Here's hoping there'll be no trouble today. Man, we have a love triangle now. We have Ulrika and we have Ulamina. When does my watch end? I don't know why I keep calling Ulrika uh Roderica. Quite the predicament. Pray in, ne'er put gold in my pocket. Oh. This ladder looks sturdy enough to climb. We ought to put it to good use. Oh, Captain Brandt, I got something for you, bud. There is much we ought to tend to if we are to strengthen your majesty's claim as a true arisen. Check out this letter from Batal. I know this sigil well. Tis the crest of the neighboring country of Batal, a land with which Vermin has no official dealings at present. Let me see. It reads, True to our word, we offer you the power of the Godsway. Pray make haste in securing Melv, that all might be made ready ere our plans are set in motion. A meager clue, to be certain. Though, tis clear that the Queen Regent conspires with Batal. This does not bode well at all. Though the political situation is stable at present, much blood has been spilt between Vermund and his neighbor in the past. I fear such a partnership would only portend the drawing of more. At any rate, 
to assume our search has led us to only more questions. Chief among them, what is meant by securing Melv and this God's way? I will investigate these matters as best I can. In the interim, Your Majesty, should you have time to spare, might you make for Melv? Only once we have gleaned a fragment of the Queen Regent's plot, can we begin to thwart it? And ere it slips my mind, pray, take this. Perchance it will help speed you on your way to Melv. Phasus. Now there's a name to remember. So we need to go to Melv now. Sir Fulvio, the artist whose service Sir Clark commissioned, is residing in Batal. Shall we go and meet with him? Methinks I know where to find the person you're looking for. Well, if you insist. I'm only glad I don't have to lead the way for a change. I guess one of the pawns that is in my party has this weird foraging or something attribute to them. All right, let's make our way to Melv. Let's put our gear back on. I don't see a quest marker for it. But we should deposit... that and we can sell the extra armor hmm that's interesting maybe we should have put that on when we were talking to Trisha yeah I don't think I'm gonna keep that Let's sleep until morning. A good sleep will ensure we are prepared. I must be vigilant. The townspeople depend on it. And we're going to sell the uh, extra armor real fast, and then we're going to take an ox cart over to Melv. Come take a look. You'll be glad you did. I'm going to sell this. Do come again. Not buying? That's just as well. Better to be selective than wasteful. The Arisen is ever prudent in the application of coin. Who's the person to talk to right here? This ox cart's bound for. I'll need to see some coin before I let you off. I will see everybody in just a moment. Made it to Melv. Only had one goblin attack. So that was nice. What are we supposed to be doing in Melv? Must hold out. Someone comes to relieve me. I gladly while away an afternoon here. Days like this make me glad to be alive. Okay. He said make for Melv. There's a ladder here. Ah, oh, excellent find. That's not acting up today. We've not to discuss. Do you have anything to say? If you want my advice, heed no advice, save your own. Alrighty. Well, glad to be alive. My legs are stiff as boards. I fear I've not you. I 
And there's nothing in Melv. What about in here? Nope, gone. Everybody legitimately left. Oh, come on, Ada. Can't make a living if I get myself injured. A mug of ale is just for Well, I guess let's go try. I'm trying this quest one more time. If it doesn't work, I'm just not even going to bother with it. Let's go over to Spellbound. We have reached our destination. There are worse ways to travel, I suppose. I don't know why he said go to Melv. In another world, I learned that a forgotten riftstone lies nearby. Shall I escort you there, Master? No, I'm not worried about the riftstone. Thank you, though, Lucy. I'm not even bothering with the goblins. Because I'm not going to rest. If that little girl doesn't talk to me, then... Oh, you know what I should do, though? Not go to items. Go to equipment. Go to rings. Let's remove that and put that on. Get our stamina refill real fast. Need some healing, Lucy. Stay with me, Arisen. Wait right there. Before we do is rest. Let us return once we've grown tired from our labors. Uh, they followed me in here. Thought we lost him. Oh my god, the lightning is blinding, man. Are we done? My studies are proceeding a pace. Alright, fuck off, little you, girl. Sir. I don't care. That's it. I'm done with that quest. Tells me to come back in a few days. It's been well over a few days. Oh, 
Let's go, ladies. This is rather thrilling. This was a waste of time. I'm sorry, everybody. Went to Melv. There was nothing to do in Melv. I was like, oh, surely this quest should be ready to turn in. Nope. I don't know if maybe I broke the quest somehow. Perhaps I don't know. Seem of maybe I was supposed to do it earlier and I didn't. Women all. And yet no two of us are the same. I have no clue what's going on with that quest. And what do they consider a few days? Two weeks? I'm really loving this game, but sometimes the quest layout, at least this quest alone, has given me the most trouble. Finding the Grimoires, and then I had somebody else, I don't remember what their name was, but they wanted Grimoires, the same Grimoires as well. If you didn't know about the black market, the guy that can make forgeries, you would have just given all your Grimoires to him instead Hell, finding the Grim Wars were pretty difficult, which is fine. It's That's not what I'm complaining about. It's mostly that it's such a convoluted quest. You don't really have any direction in it at all. Apologies, but I can't offer... Of course you can't. Let's wait for another ox cart. We'll go to Vernworth, and then after Vernworth, or well, after we get to Vernworth, we will go ahead and see if there's another main quest to do. This ox cart's bound for Vernworth. I'll need to see some coin before I let you on. All right, everybody, I'll see you all in just a second. I'm in fine fettle today. Where are you going? That went rather well. I didn't have to fight anything. It was straight to Vernworth. This ladder looks sturdy enough to climb. We ought to put it to good use. Let's wait right here, see if Captain Brant has anything for us to... I did not mean to get up. Be a few heavy Anything for us to do. Well met, sir. And a sharp resist. As a reward for your majesty's efforts, you have been invited to attend the coronation. To it seem, congratulations are in order. You will, of course, require Raymond befitting of the occasion. I would ask that your majesty return once you have procured such attire. Oh, great. We gotta dress all spiffy. My house is this way. When does my watch end? I've clean forgotten. Let's equip. We ought to bring word of this to Captain Brandt. Yeah, that's where I'm going, lady. There is much we ought to tend to, if we are to strengthen your majesty's claim as a true arisen. Let's go ahead and go to the coronation. Or shall change once we have attended the coronation. If your majesty has any unfinished business to attend to, tis best you do so before we depart. 
Nope, I think I'm all set. Very well. The coronation is to take place on the morrow. We shall depart early in the morn, so your majesty would do well to get a good night's rest. Master, pray leave this place. My body, it refuses to obey me. There is a voice within my mind. It commands me, sways my very will. Sways your will? Could it be that the gods sway? We must quit this place, your majesty. I fear our plans may fall to naught. Let us return to the tavern. We've been had. The false sovereign commanded the pawns at the coronation, proving his own powers arisen. According to Regent King Sven, the pretender was wearing some sort of lavish necklace at the time. I imagine this artifact is the god's way mentioned in that letter. Perchance it is a tool that grants power akin to that of the true arisen. It would do much to explain the events that we have beheld afore now. Alas, unless we find some way to unmake this God's way's power, proving your majesty's legitimacy shall be difficult indeed. Allow me to speak to the agent we captured some days past. Perchance he knows aught of use. Never could I have imagined such an outcome. What manner of artifact is this God's way? I suppose it's pointless to ponder. Let us await the results of Captain Brandt's investigation. Right you are. That was a very interesting cutscene. Now we know how they're controlling the pawns. I was actually quite curious on that. We must rest. They're the... Good morrow, everyone. Come, we've much to be getting on with. Shall we get underway? Wonder if we can talk to Captain Brandt or if we still have to wait. Do not forget that we work to serve the citizenry. Yeah, we're gonna have to wait until nightfall. There is much we ought to tend to, if we are to strengthen your majesty's claim as a true arisen. So did you get any information? If the information we pry from the agent is to be believed, there is a place in Batal devoted to the study of arts most queer. I believe it is worthy of investigation. Should fortune smile upon us, your majesty may even discover some method of undoing the god's way's hold over the pawns. Yet official dealings twixt Vermund and Vital are suspended, and tis no simple matter to gain passage through the latter's fortress. Fortunately for us, however, the agent was hiding this on his person. I bid you take it. Tis an entry permit, allowing passage through Batal's fortress. It even bears the crest of the Batali Palace. It must have been commissioned by someone with great influence. I doubt any would dare impede your passage with such an item in your possession. There is one other thing, Your Majesty. With the permit came information I found most intriguing. 
An oracle who once served in the Vermondian court now resides in Batal. This oracle foretold the coming of the Arisen and was banished from the kingdom when her prophecy displeased the Queen Regent. Indeed, t'was by this same oracle's power that the agent in question came to know of your majesty's whereabouts. The oracle knows much of the Arisen. Should you make her acquaintance, she may be able to offer you aid during your infiltration. Oh, awesome. We got another port crystal. You have my fullest confidence. Do not forget that we work to serve. What to make of this? No, I don't want the sculptor's block. Looks like they're right by each other, these quests. I'm I'm not I'm not doing spellbound. I'm so aggravated with that. Perhaps a journey to Batal will aid us in unraveling the secrets of the Godsway. Very well. I'll guide you there directly. We're in your hands, sir. Much obliged. Well, let's rest until morning. Shall we get some rest then? You the Arisen. I've been looking for you. Sven wants to meet with you. Says he'll be waiting in his quarters. Great. Have a few monsters to start the day off. Come, we've much to be getting on with. Let's get our gear out here. Feeling rested, I trust. Doing about a dozen things at once. I've trained for this. Sven's quarters. I don't think we went to his quarters. Do we have a quest marker? We do not. So we're just gonna have to find him, I suppose. And I think we need to go to the checkpoint rest town. Let us endeavor to keep up. Though we are less fleet of foot. I've more time than I know how to spend. Hmm. Where might I go to spend some time the only place I can find time? Have no fear, master. I'll fare all right without you for a little while. It's not our place to hurry the arisen. I kind of want to um, switch my vocation over to the Mystic Spear Hand. Let's go this way. This way. And I think... And it's always so dark in here. And then I think right up here is where we got upstairs. I know it was a spiral staircase. Can we look at the map and find where Sven's... No. So we're just going to have to make some guesses here. Seems well here, but you can never be sure. <laughs> I heard from Captain Brandt that you plan to make for Batal in order to continue your investigation. That's hilarious. The first room I check, I find Sven's room. Awesome. As for me, I've been looking into my mother's movements since last we met, and I happen upon this. Tis a letter she discarded, only half written. It seems to be addressed to someone called Phasus. 
I passed an eye o'er it, though I failed to grasp its meaning, or, or what compelled her to throw it away. Here, I thought it best that you have it. Mayhap you could glean aught from it that I could not. And if you do, would you be so kind as to share it with me? That is only if you have the time to spare. I am in no position to make demands, of course. Maybe I should go talk to um, Captain Brant. I do not need any more courtly attire. Mayhap I'll come here when I have a day to myself. Want some in a real battle? I'll prove my work. How do we get out of here? Great. I am lost. I think this way. Yes. Mayhap I'll come here when I have Mayhap I'll buy myself a new sword next time. Today. To look forward to, but a long busy day with their own affairs, I see. When does my Where watch end? I've clean forgotten. See that griffin flying off in the distance? Super awesome. I love seeing stuff like that in games. Makes you feel like the world is truly alive. Only person I believe in is myself. I don't know. There's a ladder here. Off to you, Arisen. Holy fuckamoly, ladies. Enough with the ladders. You all have an obsession, truly, with some ladders. Let's equip our gear. And then we will deposit all this other stuff here. And then Let's wait until night time so we can talk to Captain Brant. Sleep will ensure we are prepared for the It appears night has fallen while we slept. Slept lively. Journey by starlight shall make for a nice change of pace. Feeling rested, I trust. Where's Captain Brant at? Oh, there you are. As a matter of fact, you have my fullest confidence. Oh, we can't Do give him the letter? That we That's lame. Okay, well, we'll rest until morning. Uh, no, we won't. We'll just wait for an ox cart up here. Pretty sure we need to go to the checkpoint rest town. Welcome to Bjorn and quality is what you need if you want to survive. So that's and that. Five. Many thanks. I appreciate the. I'm gonna put that port crystal down in the checkpoint rest town so we can get there a little easier. When we don't want to use an ox cart. Very well. I shall return. Now was 
What is this ox cart's back? I'll not take you anywhere till I've had my due. I will see everybody in just a second. Made it to Melv. We did not make it to Melv. I'm stupid. We made it to um, Checkpoint Rest Town. What are we... Hold on. What quest are we on? Where should we put this? Kind of want to put it at the entrance there, but ox carts come through there. So I kind of don't want to put it there. This looks pretty open. Got anything to say? Have you need of me? You? My only object is to live to a right. Ho there, faring all right. Let's put our port crystal down right here. It is done, master. Now a fairy stone can whisk us here whensoever we desire. Yes, yes, it can. A merchant, eh? Have you an entry permit? Hold a moment. That cart has priority. Lord Phasus is come! Open the gates! Seek to enter Batal, I presume? I'll have to check your permit. Well, here it is. Go on through. Got to find more places to buy my soft cheek. You gonna let us through? That Lord faces we keep running across the border. Cool. We got a trophy. We keep running into him. But I think right here is where we're going to end the video. And when we come back, we will start working on, I guess, Batal. I'm going to assume this is Batal in the southern region here. Man, there's a lot to explore. We'll definitely be exploring it in good time. I still have not explored up here. I think I will do that off recording later on. But for now, we are going to end the video. I think right about here. Right here sounds like a sounds. <laughs> right here looks like a good place to end. All right, everybody. I want to start by telling everyone thank you so very much for stopping by and watching the video. It really does mean a lot to me. Hopefully you all enjoyed it. If you did, go ahead and hit that thumbs up button. If you didn't hit the thumbs down button, let me know why down in the comments below. It only helps the channel. Also, if you enjoy content just like this, be sure to subscribe or don't. I don't know. I'm not your dad. Do whatever you want. And like always, everybody have a good morning, a good afternoon or a good night. Whatever time it may be in your part of the world, Mr. John Wayne, signing off.